Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Emma. I make content on interior design and home styling. So today's video is going to be in two parts. The first part, I would like to share with you some homeware items that I got for my home. In the second part of the video, I'll be sharing with you my home decor line that I recently started and I'm super excited about. I'm currently carrying two items to start and hopefully these get you excited as I am and you can be able to support me. So, without too much talking, let me just get into the whole part of the video and then I will show you my merch later. So, I will start with the items that I first got from Little More Kenya. And Little More are located along Mombasa Road, inside Imara Mall. I think they're on the first floor. So, the first things that I got from their store are these forks and spoons. These were going for 120 bob a piece and for obvious reasons I bought them because of the wooden detail at the end. So I love these. I will be definitely going back for more of these. The other stuff that I got from Little More Kenya are these plastic spoons, forks and knives for my toddler. And these are a set of three. And these were 250 for all these. And then the other thing I got from Little More is this um, plate for my toddler again. And this is made of melamine and this was going for 250 as well. The last things that I got from Little More are these um, three melamine cups. And I like these because um, they're unlike they're not like the typical um, plastic cups you see around one and then secondly I love the brown on them these are also made of melamine so they could break if you drop them these were 80 bob a piece only yeah so I only needed three that's what uh, that's all I got so from house of leather I got firstly these jars these I have been seeing around a lot on Instagram stores. I've also seen them in, Kami, in Kamukunji. I bought mine at um, House of Leather and these were 300 a piece. I only got two pieces to start, but I will definitely be going back for more. I intend to use this for my spices and I like the wooden detail on the top and they're also airtight. So yeah. These are 300. I bet if you check in Kamukunji, you could get them for cheaper. I'm not sure. Just speculating. But I'm sure you can get them there. Again, from House of Leather, I got these um, fake eucalyptuses. And I got four stems. One, two, three, four. I got four stems of these. And these were 500 bob a stem. And the reason I bought this is because I want to use them as props for my pictures for Instagram. Again, I wish I had gotten them in um, the jungle green shade. But this will have to do. So these were 500 a stem and I'll definitely be going back for more. Because I really like the full look of eucalyptuses in like a ceramic pot. That makes sense. The other stuff that I got from House of Leather are these glasses and these I was really really excited about. They were only going for 150, 150 bob a piece. I got three pieces. It almost gives off a retro kind of vibe. So these I really really liked. The last bunch of items that I got from House of Leather are these ceramic plates. I really, really like the shape of it. I think I've seen similar plates in Car 4 going for over a thousand shillings. Not in the same, not in the same color, but in the same style, same size as well, and same shape. This I got from House of Leather for three hundred bob, and I got three to start, and I'll definitely be going back for more of these plates that's everything from house of leather from kamukunji i got 
these acrylic baskets i got three of them there's that one as you can see i've already started using them there's that one and there's also this one i got these in this i got three of those and two of these so these were 400 and these were 450 this I like because of the minimalist look of, the, of it and they really really go well with organization in the fridge. You can use them in the pantry as well but I personally don't, I prefer <coughs> woven baskets in my pantry. So I've been using this in my fridge and I love love, absolutely love them. Yeah so those are the only stuff I got from Kamukunji. Then lastly I thrifted um, these jars from River Road and these were a hundred bob a piece. I bought three but broke one so I only have these two left. These are was such a steal and I was super excited to find them. Again from the same vendor, I thrifted these two clear mugs. These were 150 bob a piece. I absolutely love the size of them and the shape of them and yeah we're done with the first part of the video i'd like to now share with you um two products that we're currently carrying on my home decor line house kenya so the first product is this handmade hand woven water hyacinth near basket and this is perfect for organization in the pantry or even in your closets so that's how it looks we're currently stocking them in the sizes medium and large. The second item we are currently carrying are our Eshi basket lamps. So I have one installed in my bedroom. So if I could just show it to you, let me do that. So guys, that's how it looks. Very, very minimal, very boho chic. So that's our Eshi basket lamp. guys so feel free to reach out to me either on instagram or tiktok or even here in the comment section on youtube if you wish to snag either our near or ashy lamps that's the whole video thank you guys so much for watching i promise to be a little bit more consistent on here again feel free to subscribe and follow me until the next one bye